Today, let's work on a relaxing yoga practice to help us make the transition from the workday to a relaxing evening. My name is Zalinda and I specialize in teaching yoga so that people with all kinds of bodies can participate and benefit. Let's get started. Begin in a comfortable standing position. Your feet can be any width that's comfortable for you. Let your toes turn in the direction that's comfortable for them. And then lengthen your spine and relax your shoulders. Spend a little time just paying attention to your breathing, smoothing your inhales and your exhales. And if it feels comfortable for you, you can start to lengthen your inhales and exhales. Try to keep all of your attention on your breathing. Find any detail related to your breathing to pay attention to. Very good, let's start some moving now. So on an inhale, bring your arms forward and up, lengthen your spine. Exhale, bring your arms forward and down. Let's go again, inhale, arms forward and up. Exhale, forward and down. Two more, inhale. In fact, go at your pace if you prefer. Whenever you finish, let your arms relax down. Go ahead and step your feet wider. And we'll start to work on stretching out the sides of the body. On an inhale, extend your arms out toward the sides. Exhale, side bend toward your left. Inhale, up to the center. Exhale, over toward your right. Inhale, to the center. Then exhale and release your arms down. There's the whole sequence. Inhale, arms stretch out. Exhale, left side bend as far as is comfortable for you. Inhale to the center. Exhale, over toward the right. Inhale to the center. Exhale, arms rest down. We're gonna do two more rounds. Inhale smoothly. Let your breath last the length of your movement. Exhale to your left, breathing the whole time. Inhale smoothly to the center. Exhale all the way over toward your right. Inhale up to the center. Exhale slowly and smoothly, the arms come down. Please do one more round. Go at your breathing pace. When you finish, go ahead and step your feet together. Let's start to move into some forward folding. Please go gently. This may be the first forward fold that you do today. On an inhale, bring your arms forward and up. Exhale, bend your knees and fold as much as you are comfortable. Inhale, walk your way up. And then exhale and relax your shoulders down. Inhale, arms forward and up. Exhale, bend your knees and fold. Inhale, walk your way up. Exhale, shoulders 
Relax down. We're going to do two more. Go at your pace if you prefer. Inhale. Whenever you finish, relax your legs, relax your arms. And next, we're gonna work on a little bit of back bending because inevitably during the workday, we do some kind of hunching. So we'll counteract that now with some back bending. Step your left foot forward, keep your right foot back, turn your hips to face toward the front. Please make sure that you have some width between your stance, between your feet. So left foot on the left half of your mat, right foot on the right half, and then we can begin. So on an inhale, bend your front knee over your ankle and at the same time, bring your arms up. You're bending your elbows and bringing your arms back. Exhale, straighten your knee while bringing your arms down. Inhale, knee bends, arms move back. Exhale, knee straightens, arms go down. Two more, please go at your pace. As you finish, you can step your left foot back and then we'll continue on the other side. So right is forward, left is back, feet are wide and hips are facing toward the front. You know the sequence now, so please feel free to do all four rounds at your own pace. You can keep your abdominal muscles engaged, your belly button drawing in. You can keep your legs strong. Think about even keeping your arms strong and lifting your chest so you really get a nice little back bend in here. Whenever you finish, step your right foot back and you can shake your legs out a little bit. Let's wrap up the standing part of practice with a wide-legged forward fold. So step your feet wide. On an inhale, bring your arms forward and up. Exhale, bend your knees, fold as much as you're comfortable. You can rest your hands on your legs or on the floor or even on blocks if you have them. Stay here for an inhale. Stay here for an exhale. Then inhale, you can bend your knees and walk your way up. And then exhale and relax your shoulders. Inhale smoothly, the arms forward and up. Exhale, bend your knees and fold as much as you're comfortable. Stay for an inhale. Stay for an exhale. Then inhale, walk your way up. Exhale, shoulders relax. We're going to do two more. You can add intensity if you want to. I'll show you how but go ahead and go at your pace. Don't forget to stay for the inhale and the exhale. And then if you're adding intensity, you could stretch your arms forward and up and then exhale and bring your arms forward and down. One more round, your style, your pace. Very nice work. Go ahead and step your feet together and then move to a comfortable lying down position. When you get there, you can keep your legs bent or straight, but please do stretch your arms out and turn your palms face up. As you settle into your lying down position, take your feet out just a little bit wider, maybe even as wide as a yoga mat. 
But we're going to do a little bit of twisting with the lower body to release tension from the low back and the back of your pelvis and also the hips and the legs. So from this wide foot position, keep your feet where they are. Bring both knees over toward the left. On an inhale, bring your knees back up to the center. And then exhale over toward the right side. Keep going. You can go at your pace. You're inhaling when your knees move to the center and exhaling when your legs go to one of the sides. As you work your way through a few repetitions here, see if you can pinpoint any areas that feel tight or tense. And also notice if those tight areas start to loosen up as you continue to make your way through this little sequence. Next time you complete the right side, bring your knees back to the center and you can bring your feet a little bit closer toward each other. Bring your arms down alongside your body, but keep your elbows bent so your elbows are pointing out a little bit and your palms are close by your hips. We're gonna do some movement with the arms to help release tension in the shoulders and in the neck. So on an inhale, bring your bent left arm up toward the ceiling or the sky if you're outside like me and bring your bent arm back behind your head. Your hand is going to land just right behind your head and then exhale. The bent arm moves again up toward the ceiling and then down by your left hip. Now the right side. Inhale. The arm moves up and back. Exhale. Arm moves up toward the ceiling and down. Inhale on the left side. Exhale, left side goes down. Inhale, the right arm up and back. Exhale, right arm up toward the ceiling and down. Keep going, go at your breathing pace. If you're up for a little bit more challenge, draw your belly button downward toward your spine. And that act of engaging your abdominal muscles will give you more stability in your low back, which means that you'll get more benefit from this movement in your upper back. In other words, more stretching in your thoracic spine, more relaxation around your shoulders. Next time you complete the right arm, go ahead and bring it down. And then extend your arms out toward the sides. And if it's comfortable for you, also extend your legs. And we're going to work now on stretching out the sides of the hips, sides of the thighs, and also the side of your waist. So from this position, take little steps and walk your feet over toward the left side, just as far as they'll go. And then let your legs stay here. The weight of your legs will keep your legs in place. Stay for three breaths. And as you're breathing, you'll start to notice some sensations coming up in your low back, in the back of your pelvis, somewhere in that region. Things will start to stretch out a little bit. Maybe even in your abdominal muscles. After three breaths are complete, walk your feet to the center and then continue walking your legs over toward the right side and then just let them stay. And again, stay here for three breaths. Try to make your breathing long and smooth. You can start to notice what you're feeling when your legs are now in this position toward the right. It's not surprising if the two sides of your body feel different from each other. It's just because we have habits about how we use our body throughout the day. Maybe you spend a lot of time leaning onto your left side, so you feel more tightness on that side. Okay, after your three breaths, go ahead and walk your feet to the center and then bend your knees. 
reposition your hips if needed so that they're comfortable. And do a little, like a small sort of twist with your knees from side to side. We're just relaxing the body, releasing any tension that may have come up from that previous posture that we were working on. Very good work. So one thing that's really important to help make the transition from work day to relaxing evening is that we should do some breathing practice. So when you're ready, roll to one side. Ease your way up to a comfortable sitting position. And in fact, please feel free to sit on a chair if that's more comfortable for you. Any sitting position will do. When you get there, you can rest your hands on your knees or on your legs, palms face down or up, whatever you like. And if it's comfortable for you, you can close your eyes. And if that's not comfortable, you can keep them open. Start to smooth out your breathing. And for today's breathing practice, we're going to do a little bit of counting. So what you'll do is count, just slowly count the length of your inhale and also slowly count the length of your exhale. Try to keep the numbers pretty even. You can begin the counting whenever you're ready. If it feels comfortable for you, you can gradually start to lengthen your breath, both the inhale and exhale component. Just be cautious that you're not overextending to the point where your breathing becomes uncomfortable. So now you're doing long, comfortable breaths. Try to keep all of your attention with your breathing. If you find that your mind is wandering off, ask your mind to really focus on the counting, keeping the counting very smooth and rhythmic. Next time you complete an exhale, return to natural breathing. Very good work. I hope that you're feeling relaxed and have successfully made the transition from your work day. Now you're ready to have a peaceful and relaxing evening and a good night of sleep. Thank you for practicing with me. I'll see you next time. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're interested in deepening your practice with longer sessions, please consider joining me and my team of teachers for live sessions via Zoom. I'll put the information in the description box below. See you next time.